Mason loved hockey. He played hockey almost every day. He played in the backyard. He played on the ice. He played on his iPad. He played it in the basement. And he played it on the trampoline. He played it on the street and at the cabin. He even played air hockey at the hospital. But why would he play air hockey at the hospital? Well, Mason had cancer. I'm just out to find. He found one day when a lump was on his neck. It was scary at first, but then it was even scarier because of the needles at the hospital. At the hospital, Mason didn't think about hockey that much because he was thinking more about surviving or not. For fun in the hospital, Mason played all sorts of games. He played chess, he played Uno, he played memory. He would even dark gun the nurses. One day when his hair fell out, he got a fake hair hat that he would wear every once in a while. But most of the time he wore mustaches. Once Mason sprayed one of the nurses, his name was Kevin. He sprayed him water from a syringe and it looks like he peed his pants. When Mason got out of the hospital, he saw a hockey stick laying in the backyard and remembered about hockey and started playing again. But he couldn't get his old moves back for a little while. So Mason practiced and practiced, and finally he got all his moves back. Now he has more moves than he even used to. He learned a lot from his favorite player, Sidney Crosby. He would watch videos on YouTube, but when he thought about getting in the NHL, he knew that you had to be a teenager. That was a long way away, so he waited and waited and waited. And when he was 18, he finally got drafted by the Pittsburgh Penguins and got to play with Sidney Crosby. And one day he was even better than Sidney Crosby. Look at that. Kick save.